38 Marina Street, of course, here in Ginger Lee. Thomas Goodwin is my name. It is an absolute pleasure to be your auctioneer. Of course, our marketing agents have got Curtis here on my right, uh, Ruben through the centre here, here to answer any questions that you may have in relation to the property to make you feel as comfortable as possible moving forward and owning a great piece of real estate. For the buyer amongst you, which we know there are many, well, this is a great chance, a great chance for you to buy a property. Not only has great land content, but is perfectly positioned in this location, close to the river, close to all of your public and private amenities. There is so much to get excited about this particular property, ladies and gentlemen. The only thing left for you to do is back your judgment in and make this property your own. I wish you well with your bidding. Well, all our relevant documentation, our contract of sale and our terms and conditions have been on display prior to the commencement of the auction. All of that documentation is taken to be read and understood at this stage of the process. But if I may just for a brief moment remind you of the following. Your contract of sale, it is clean, it is cash, it is entirely unconditional. Even better is the fact that what you bid will be what you pay, no GST applicable. We're looking for today $20,000 out to 10% as your deposit and we're looking to settle on the 4th of May. The terms and conditions, well, they don't change from auction to auction here in the state of Queensland. They are simply as follows. The highest approved bidder will be the buyer, subject to the reserve price and, of course, the seller's approval. Now, the seller may bid today exclusively through myself as the auctioneer, known to as a seller or a vendor bid. If we do choose to exercise that right, you can be assured of two simple things. The first thing being be done in a completely open and transparent manner. The second thing being it will be done well below the reserve price. You must be registered to place a bid. And if you do place your bid, please could you hold the lock your number identifier each and every single time you do indeed place your bid. Now, if the fast talk gets you excited and you think the yibbity yibbity wants to get you into the bidding, please note we can take registrations right up until the third and final call. We just need some identification. The team can get you into the bidding just as soon as we have that. Well, buyers, there are our terms. That's our contract of sale. Those documents should only give you complete confidence and moving forward and owning this morning. So again, I wish you well with your buying endeavours. Well, before we get to the exciting part of what we're all here for, that's to see who is going to be our lucky new owner, let's have a quick discussion about what we have on offer. And if I can briefly just take you further afield around this particular location here in Jindalee. And of course, I mentioned earlier, perfectly positioned close to the river, but also so close to everything you love about this particular area. Of course, all of your shops, schools and public transport, well, that's only a stone's throw away. You've also got seamless access back in to Brisbane CBD for the professional amongst you. But all the while, they come back to this wonderful location where the neighbours and the local community, they're testament to the fact this is a place you'd love to, to, to let your family grow up, but also for you to be able to enjoy living 2015 and beyond. Uh, the home itself, we're, we're positioned on 660 square metres of prime blue chip real estate. Uh, perched upon this land content is a home that it really just is so livable. It's got great fun. Let's see if we can make that happen. So, without further ado, opening bidder off to get us underway. Where do we go? Where do we kick negotiations off? Where do we get things going? Where do we start the negotiation, buyers? Where do we kick things off? It's in your hands. Where do we go? And that crow comes in right on to you, doesn't it? Come in. Open with a full seven. Okay, the cheeks are cheery, sharp man, but I'll take you forward there, two hundred and seventy thousand dollars, and I'll see if I can go north with this twenty thousand dollar lot to get it going. This particular stage, man. So four ninety will be. Buddy. 490, good to see you man, 490, and quick is a good bit man, so good on you, 490 and 510, and 510, back in front at 510, at 510, bit down 30 man would be the next bit, and 30, back in front, on the left against us now on the right, so Kurtz, at 530,000, 5 and a half would be, would be the next bit, at 530, bit down, yes, 530 bit against you man, 550 would be, 550, back in front at 550, for at five and a half. Two people bidding back against you, man. At $550,000 and 70, and you bid with confidence, oh man, well below a recent sale. 550 off and 70 would be the courtesy at $550,000 bid, and I still would expect you to see your hands across the crowd at that level.
level. It's just very, very good buying. At $550,000 fall with my starter, two people being this particular stage, and the bid's on the right. Your chance to come forward. It's great buying at this particular level. It's five and a half fall and five seventy to get us back in front, buyers. What do we say? At five and a half bid here on the right. I'll give everyone a chance to think it through for a moment. At five and a half fall, you think about the land content. 660 square metres, the home, the location. The recent sales are above $600,000. This is good buying at $550,000 bid now. Not going to delay. And 70 is the courtesy. First opportunity now, five and a half call at $550,000 bid. And bid on the right. Against you, man. Happy to go to 70. At 550 bid now, what do we say? Second chance at $550,000 to be away here on the right against the centre. It's five and a half call. Winning offer at this stage, man, and good luck. And look on a five and a half bid for that first. And final time now, five and a half call. What do we say? Any further offer at $550,000 bid. Okay, I'll take it. Back in front through the centre. And it's against you. Three people bidding now. It's a desirable home there. Desirable home. It's $560,000 call. And happy to go to 70. 70 is next. Taking 10 to this particular stage. And happy to give you that chance now. 60 bid now through the middle. And then you can go 570 and enter back into the race if you'd like. At 560,070. Sorry. No 10s is courtesy this particular stage, man. 550 bid. Only because it's good buying 70 to get you back in front. Come with me now. 60 bid straight through the middle. And 70 to get you back in front. 60 bid. Only taking 10s at this stage. At $560,000 call. And 60 is the bid now. Only because it's great buying, man. Happy to go to 70. 70. Good to see you. Nearly had it in at 70 call now. And it's against you, sir. 80. A quick bid. Shows positive intent, sir. It shows a strong negotiation style. At 570 offered here with my starter at 70 bid now. At $570,000 bid away, 570000 offered here on the right and still good buying this level, ladies and gentlemen. You should be getting excited and bidding with some supreme confidence at $570,000 bid away and not going to delay. First opportunity now, $570,000 bid at 570000 offered here with my starter. Four people bidding, no. That should give you confidence, buyers. That will long remain into the future. You buy today, you reap the rewards well, well, well into the future. 570 offered now, straight through the centre. 80 is courtesy. Old Breed, I'll give everyone a chance to think about it for a moment. 570 is offered, straight through the middle, and 80 would be the courtesy buyers. So what do we say? You sing it out, I'll write it up. And the more you think about it, the more it makes sense. At 570 offered, first maturity, second chance before we go. What we say, 570,000 dollars winning offer. Man, this particular stage, you're in the box seat. Good luck and look on now. At 570,000 dollars, are we sure we're done? Finished, silence announced. Third and final time. Take 575. Tough negotiators, all right. I'll certainly take the five at this particular stage, but I have to give everyone that same opportunity. So five and three quarters, good to see you back in it. And 80 to get us back in front at this particular point, man. It's back against you at 575 bid, and 80 is the next bid. Moves there swiftly, man, but still great buying. 575 offered back here. I'll lower my tone at this particular point. Maybe that pro can chime on in for a bit longer. At 575 offered now, what do we say? You think about you walk along the river. You're in a great locale here, buyers. And hate to see you miss this opportunity. At 575, man, the bid's against you. And it's on the left, against here, through the centre and the right, and the centre through here. At 575 offered. First opportunity. 80. We're at 75, happy to go to 80. Well, that knockout bid of even 600,000, man, maybe that's a strategy <laughs> worth considering. At 575 offered now, straight through here, in the centre now. Hey, we laugh, but it's worked in the past. And 80. Good to see you back in front. At 80 call now, 580 offered. Back with my starter. Maybe we work for it though. Shows it's a great property though. With this level of interest buyers, it's worth fighting over. At $580,000 offered. Straight through here in my starter. In pole position, you might just say. Happy to see someone come in from the outside lane and take it back off them though. At $580,000 and 85's next. At 70, what do we say? 80 bit. 85. You never question it. 
the river. It makes sense now. 585 did the call. What do we say, buyers? At 85 on top of the five. Straight through here at 585,000. And may I make suggestions? 585,000 reasons still to bid at this level. At 85 offered now. What do we say? Back here, far left. So happy to get you back in the race if you like. It's just to the point. <laughs> what do we say, man? Easy for you to get back in if we can. At 585 offered and 90, man. What do we say? Not going to delay the biddies against you. 2,500. Okay, I'll take that. 87 and a half. <laughs> I will take two and a half though. That's shortening my stride by 50%. That's a great chance. Okay, 87 and a half call now. 87 and a half. That could be down to the last leg, this particular point. You just don't know. You can stretch a little bit more. It could be what it needs to be. 587500 off the here, back on the rise at 87 and a half bid. I can't pick the pattern though, so you're a chance to come forward here. Certainly every little bit counts at 587 and a half call. Not going to delay buys. First chance now, 587,000. 500 offered. Every party here needs to think about this. This could be a life changing decision. At 587 and a half call, straight through the middle now, 87 and a half bid. Second chance now, buys. And I put this to you, when you're looking to buy property here in Brisbane, you look for a few things. Number one, though, you look for quality. You look for quality in location. You look for quality in the dwelling, quality in the land content. We've got quality in spades and quality long that remains. Certainly long after price is forgotten. 87 and a half call now, straight to the middle now. Happy to go northward to 590 if we can on that third. And final time, winning offer, 587 and a half bid now here. And it's on the right against us here in the centre and the far right. Are we sure? Are we completely out? Are you sure, mate? Completely sure? <laughs> I'll take it to you after the talk with Mace and King of driving through. No, we could have picked it up for an extra even $1,000. 587 and a half call bid is here. And it's through in the centre again. Are we absolutely sure, ladies and gentlemen? Have I got your best? 587 and a half call straight through the centre here. All right, what we might just do at this particular stage, bid in your favour, man, at 587 and a half. It's a big decision for all parties involved. I understand that. We will just pause the auction for a brief moment, give our sellers the opportunity to think this decision through, give our buyers the chance. We really do appreciate your patience and appreciate uh, certainly waiting around this particular point. Uh, we do appreciate the negotiations, sir, man. Just confirming, has increased your offer to $590,000. Yes, and ladies and gentlemen, I can announce that there is no further bid. We welcome new owners. We are selling the property. We're on the market playing for keys. It's five hundred and ninety thousand dollars when the contract hits my hand after the third call. We will not be reopening, making that crystal clear. No mate, low late bids accepted. At $590,000, and a quick bid would be a good bid at this particular point, given, given we're at the pointy end of the auction. At $590,000 call now, bid straight through the centre, not going to delay. That sold sign will go out the front, and if you don't bid now, you will miss your chance. At $590,000 call, first chance now, five ninety offers. Second opportunity and selling. Straight through the middle here, winning offer at five hundred and ninety thousand dollars called buyers. And again, like I said, there is no tomorrows at this particular point. There is only regrets at five hundred and ninety thousand dollars called straight through the middle now for that third and final time at five hundred and ninety thousand dollars. Has the market spoken? Have I got our best at five ninety called? Good luck and we'll come this particular point at five ninety bid. Got to be quick, Curtis. We give everyone plenty of opportunity to think this decision through. The bid straight through the middle at five hundred and ninety thousand dollars call. Got to be quick, though, Curtis. Five hundred ninety thousand dollars call on the third and final time. Man, you've got to be quick. This particular point we're selling. We're welcoming new owners. Have I got your best, man? Quickly, man. 590 bid. $590,000, Curtis. I am going to sell it now at this particular point. We've 
got to be in it to win it though. From the third and final call. On the right and against the centre at 591 bid again. We've said that before at $591,000 the call. Maybe sure, $500. It could, it could just do it. It seems on the last lead at this particular point. I hate to see you miss it. You sure? Okay, appreciate that. 591 offered. Not going to delay now. First pursuit is $591,000 call. Second chance before we go at 591 bid here on the right for that third. And final time, we sell it out, buyers. Make no mistake, in your favour. I gave them the opportunity. Are we, are we sure? Yeah. Are we sure? Yeah. Okay, well, I really do appreciate the bid at this particular point. Don't underestimate the value there. At 591 bid, we sell it out, buyers. Make no mistake, we sell. We sell. And sold. Congratulations. Well bought. If you'd like to see the same sold result, please speak to the team from McGrath. Until the next auction, thank you very much.